This is Tom and I'm here from skis.com today to talk to you a little bit about layering. Layering is the most efficient way to stay warm and dry out on the mountain. It also gives you the ability to quickly adjust and adapt as the weather conditions change. So let's break down the layering process. The first thing you want to start with, and this is top pants and socks, a thin wicking layer commonly known as a base layer. For this, you want it to be some type of synthetic or wool, as these are both naturally wicking materials. The next layer you want to think about is your mid-layer. These will either be synthetic, wool, down, or even wicking flannel. You'll even find these in a combination of these materials on occasion. You want to avoid cotton here. Your favorite hoodie is only going to absorb moisture and make you cold out on the mountain. Mid-layer bottoms aren't commonly worn, but there are a few options out there for riders who get cold easily. Your last layer and first line of defense against the elements is called your outerwear. For this, you're going to want a jacket and pant that are both windproof and waterproof. You'll find insulated and shell varieties here. The insulated types are going to offer more warmth, but a little additional bulk whereas the shell versions are going to be lighter weight, but on colder days may require an additional mid-layer to keep you warm. This is Tom from skis.com, and I hope this video is gonna keep you warm out on the mountain. Thanks for watching.